beautiful moist cake who hates that word moist hello good afternoon it is i think 3 30 pm and um the reason why i started vlogging this late is because i had some stuff to do and also because i'm not feeling all too happy and i was like oh okay maybe if i just wait then it will go away but it's not going away um i'm feeling quite anxious and this may sound a little bit crazy because it's because uh, a lot of amazing things are happening and the thing no one will tell you about your dreams coming true is that it's very very scary to step into that reality where everything you ever dreamed of is it's just happening and um, the thing I am dealing with on a regular basis and I talk about it a lot with Stefan and my friends and my brother um, is the imposter syndrome if you are not familiar with it it's the feeling you know when you're having um, success and I'm not saying like I'm a massive success or whatever no 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 I'm not saying that but there are like really great things happening and then you start feeling like um, I'm not this good and or I'm not going to be able to live up to expectations of the people that I'm working with and stuff like that so um, the reason why I'm sharing with you is because uh, you guys know me so well and you know exactly when I'm not feeling okay so let me just put it out in the open and not you know try to make it look better than it is I'm just feeling a little bit anxious um, as a distraction I'm currently walking towards the um, there's like a little shopping mall here in the area and I'm going to buy some baking stuff and I'm going to bake my favorite Yugoslavian um, cakes this evening because that's relaxing and also that's one of the things that, <laughs> that I will need to do in the upcoming weeks and I just want to be prepared it just gives me anxiety because I've never made those cakes and I'm going to have to make them on camera and stuff like that so you know it's it's nothing major but for me I just want to do it right you know and I'm not a perfectionist I'm just a really hard worker and I want to do it right and yeah that's that's the dealio <laughs> baking stuff so this I need for sure a spatula and maybe even this one yeah, I think I need this one too I also need a baking tray exactly this size the thing is, it has rounded corners and I need to make cubes, so it's not very useful if it's if the corners are rounded up. Hmm. And the groceries for the cake. Okay, I bought a cake tin. Yes, it has rounded corners, but so be it. I couldn't find anything else and I was just too lazy. Also, I feel a little bit better. The sun is shining. It's really, really nice weather. This was a good distraction. I'm really looking forward to making this cake because it's my favorite Yugoslavian cake. And I used to eat it as a kid and I haven't eaten it in so long, man. Oh, that's gonna be good. Oh, by the way, this cake tin is a little bit smaller than uh, it said in the recipe, but I'm using two different recipes. So yeah, this is going to be interesting. Uh, yeah. Stay tuned for the cake man, stay tuned. Back home, I'm going to have lunch. And I was really, really craving rice cakes with cheese. God love cheese man. Also, I am going to record another episode of Road Back to India. This week I'm going to watch the Bollywood movie Zindagi Namilegi Dobara. I have no freaking idea if I pronounced that correctly. Uh, if you're interested when you're watching this, it's the episode of last Sunday. And I'm really looking forward to that. So let's do this. Just finished watching the Bollywood movie. And to be very, very honest, up until the last, I think, eight minutes, I was constantly thinking, why do they want me to watch this movie? What is there for me to learn? And then it just suddenly clicked how well you guys know me. That's just crazy. Like so many people. And I've, I've noticed this before and I've said this before, like, how do you know me so well just for my vlogs it's just crazy um yeah right now i'm going to have dinner because you know i love food too right i has made a salad for dinner so we have lettuce underneath and then some avocado tomato some nuts falafel and then i'm going to add this yogurt dip 
thingy, whatever. By the way, some Dutch people who want to comment on my English commented, it's not I can has, it's, a, it's I have. So I have made salad instead of I has made a salad. For everybody who sees this in the comments, please feel free to reply with I can has cheeseburger. <laughs> because of course that's not the correct grammar. I, I fully understand, but there is a meme. There is a meme, I will tell you, on the interwebs. Yes, I know it's the internet and not actually the interwebs. And that meme goes, I can has cheeseburger. And you should Google it. It's real fun. Om nom 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 nom. I can has salad. Mm. No, my falafel, where are you going? Mm. All right, guys, it's gonna be a baking party. Look at this. So I washed all of the new kitchen utensils. I got the ingredients over here. It's not everything, but most of it. I bought a new mixer for this because my old one broke down. The ingredients are on room temperature, which is the best way to make sure a cake doesn't fail. Apparently, if the butter is not on room temperature or the eggs or both, you have a big risk of the cake, um, you know, not being airy enough. So, let's do this. Oh, oh, I have the recipe. Ah, breaking things and stuff already. I have the recipe on Facebook. Facebook? YouTube, of course. YouTube. This lady. I thought this lady had a good story. No, 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 no. This is just me. Stop it. Stop talking. Stop it. Stop it. No, this lady. Moya mala kuchinya. And the ads. Of course, the ads come up. Stop it. Stop it. Eh, I want to show the lady. Zdravo. Ja sam Aleksandra. Zdravo, Aleksandra. Kako si? We're going to cook with Aleksandra. Let's do this. The biscuit is in the oven and it's rising real pretty. Only 10 more minutes to go. And over here I made the chocolate which needs to cool off. They both need, actually need to cool off before I can make it. Ooh, the cake is done and this turned out pretty well actually. It's, it got baked a little bit more over here but my oven is sometimes so hot. I really like this. Yes. The cake cooled off, it's nice now, and I'm going to cut it into cubes. Okay, that's not working. Okay. Yeah! Oh no, why, why? Kitchen queens. Why did this happen? Didn't I put enough oil and flour on the bottom? Why? Why? Why you hate me? Okay, apparently you really do need the amount of shredded coconut indicated in the recipe. 
Right now, I'm out of shredded coconut. <laughs> this is how much cake I have left. Do you see that? <laughs> so I will have to finish this tomorrow. Uh, but my cake is falling apart. Why is my cake falling apart? There is, may oh, I know. Maybe because I didn't let it cool, in uh, cool off enough. But all looks well. I was stressed out for nothing. This appears to be a success once it cools off. And I will report back to you on the taste, I guess tomorrow, when everything really cooled off and stiffened up and la 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 la. I couldn't help myself, man. Can you see this? Mm. So it's beautiful. Damn it. Why won't you focus? Yes, there we go. So it's beautiful, moist cake. Who hates that word? Moist. <laughs> Chocolate coconut but the coconut is not overwhelming at all it just gives it more texture and it's just oh i love this stuff it's so freaking good i will link the recipe down in the link below if you would like to make it and for now i have 20 seconds to end this log <laughs> and shilichi has them too wow if you liked it put a thumbs up and if you're not yet subscribed to my channel click that subscribe button because then you can travel along thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time bye